Well, imagine finding a slithering snake inside your home. I don't know why we say imagine, because that's just not something you'd want to imagine. One Rock Hill family, though, did just that. A snake they found curled up inside a dryer. News Channel 36 reporter Anjanette Flowers has their story. It was shocking. It's not, it's not the, like I said, it's not, I've never seen a snake like that in real life before. This is the snake Denise Cubbage is talking about. Living at the woods, you deal with snakes. But not like this one, and not four feet long, believed to have been someone's pet. She and her husband found it in their dryer after it stopped working. Saturday morning, I went to fluff the clothes, and when I turned the dryer on, it just, the engine started, the motor started, but it just wouldn't spin. And so it made a horrible noise. Even scarier, it turns out the snake likely came in through the dryer vent on the outside of the house. I guess we had been pulling it off and cleaning it too much. It had gotten loose. We get a lot of snakes in the Carolinas. Rick Seifert's job is pest control. He says a snake getting into a house this time of year is not uncommon. But a snake in a dryer? That would be very surprising. His advice, if you don't want to find a snake in your home? Make sure that your garage door seals when it goes down. Walk around your foundation. Make sure your foundation vents are secure. Advice already taken by the Cubbage family. You can see my husband replaced it and then he put all this insulation around it to <laughs> hold it in there snug. <laughs> snug and tight. And I smell moth. And they have two small kids, so they were obviously really worried about this snake. They did kill the snake, and seeing how they have now closed off that vent, doesn't look like they'll have to worry about any more unexpected visitors, at least not anytime soon. Live from the newsroom, Anjanette Flowers, News Channel 36.